Hi, I'm Rachel Passini, the newest editor on the Fluid Power World team. As a first-timer, IPB 2023 was educational and enlightening, with so much innovation on display. For instance, Mary and I stopped by Hydro, a fluid power manufacturer in Italy that has produced hydraulic valves, manifolds, connectors, accessories, and systems since 1982. In 2017, the company introduced additive manufacturing to produce metal 3D printed parts. After immense functional testing, they found that their 3D printed parts were just as good as their conventionally manufactured parts. Hydro is now a pioneer in using additive manufacturing and fluid power. They use laser powder bed fusion and binder jetting technologies to 3D print directional control valves, manifolds, heat exchangers, devices for aerospace and energy, and they've been able to use 3D printing to revolutionize designs, improve quality, and speed up production. I'm really looking forward to seeing how Hydro explores additive manufacturing and evolves the fluid power industry. Next up is a well-known fluid power company, Parker Hannafin. They released a new hydraulic hose with a critical protection cover to eliminate the impacts of hose failure, especially in mining, construction, refuse, and other harsh applications. As everyone in the industry knows, hose failure can have dangerous environmental and health and safety impacts. So in the spirit of sustainability and designing with the operator in mind, I was happy to learn that better hose protection is being prioritized to help reduce impacts. Also, though Parker is known for hydraulics, they've been on the electric side for about 40 years and recently introduced a smart electrification technology portfolio for battery-driven vehicles. At IFP, one of the products they showed was their next-generation inverters with embedded functional safety for traction control that can also be used to drive a hydraulic pump and perform work functions. They use the same hardware with two different software configurations to manage functional safety for both applications. With so much to see, it's hard to stop there. So for more IFP 2023 highlights, please check out fluidpowerworld.com or visit the Fluid Power World YouTube channel.